Hey everyone, welcome back to another exciting video guys. So finally Coen3 has released another new model and its name is Coen3 Coder, here you see. And the exciting thing is that it is very much easy to use and very much easy to install. Here you see that you will get this kind of interface here and it is completely free and open source. Here in this Hugging Face repository you will find this uh, information and also you see that i have given this prompt this one line prompt to this coin3 coder coder and here you see that it has given me a beautiful chat application you can say that reddit like community forum where you can engage with other people for discussion and it is actually looks very beautiful and it has added many things on the right hand side it has added this uh, information about this profile number of posts number of threads and also there is a new thread button and also here you see that it has maintained this nested uh, structure of the thread this is a post reply button not only this here in this video i will show you many things many interesting things about this coin3 here you see that this is one of the uh, neural network architecture the, which is made by this coin3 coder and uh, this person have posted this Coen3 Coder is on another level. I had it build a sim based on some scaffolds we are trying. The model left me a message in the sim we built. So here you see that uh, if you play this video then you will see that how it is actually moving and it is maintaining the structure. It is a 3D uh, neural network architecture. And also here you see that on the right hand side there is a uh, recursive depth knowledge gain all of that things you can see so it is made by coin3 not only this here you see that this is another uh, things uh, and the prompt is here you see that i asked to code some polygons rotating with some rules around a ball inside trying to escape and you see that this is the output a ball is trying to escape and it is um, attaching the various the boundaries and this type of things so coin3 coder is a uh, very much powerful guys now there are various ways to use it so if you go to this um, chat.coin.ai this is the official uh, link of coin chat application they are under this drop down you can select this coin3 coder a strong coding agent capable of long horizon task so this is it and uh, i have given this prompt and if you want to try it in this coin in this chat.coin.ai uh, then one thing you have to keep in your mind let me show you that so just go to this and here just make sure you selected this artifact from here here you see this is the artifact so select this artifact and after that give that prompt so i have given this prompt copy it and after that paste it here so if you do like this then only you will see the preview in this artifact and here on the right hand side you will find this deploy option also i have already deployed my uh, application so this is free guys and uh, you can share it with anyone and also you can uh, change the access here you see that public or uh, private like this and uh, if you don't want to deploy then you can click on this undeploy there are various options now you can share this with anyone so if i open it in the new tab this is the things okay now another way is uh, through this open router so if you go to this open router.ai there you will find this uh, coin3 coder by the way uh, let me give you some of the introduction about this coin3 coder model so here you see today we are announcing this coin3 coder our most agentic uh, code model to date and Coen3 Coder is available in multiple sizes, but we are excited to introduce its most powerful variant first. And this is the most powerful variants, Coder, Coen3 Coder 480 billion and 35 active billion parameter instruct model. And this is the features like significant performance among open models on agentic coding agentic browser use and uh, other fundamental coding tasks achieving results comparable to Claude Sonnet. So if I show you the benchmarks, 
as you see they have done this comparison with this Kimi K2 model and this Dipsic V3 this Claude Sonnet 4 and also OpenAI GPT 4.1 and you see that uh, this is the benchmark uh, let me show you that Kimi K2 is performing or Kimi K2 score is 30.0 but this Coen3 new coding model Coen3 coder is 37.5 and it is beating this Claude Sonnet 4 also and the interesting thing is that it is completely open source you don't have to pay any money to use this model okay and all of these uh, benchmarks are verified on this SWE bench and on this SWE bench uh, mm, uh, multi SWE bench error polygons and wave arena all of the things you see and the, another interesting thing is that uh, the CLI is very simple and they have made this CLI from the um, Gemini CLI. So let me show you that part here you see. Uh, Coin code is a research purpose CLI tool and uh, adapted from the Gemini CLI. We enhance parser tool support for Coin coder models. Okay. And uh, let me show you this uh, interesting and very easy installation process. But before that, as you see, Cloud code can be uh, used with this Coin code. So, in addition to Coin code, we can now use this Coin3 coder with the Cloud code. Okay. And uh, for that, this is the simple procedure. Now, let me go to this GitHub repository so that you can use this Coin3 coder in CLI. Okay. So, this is the GitHub repository uh, link that is given in description Coin code. So, if you go there, and they have written these things that coin code is a coding agent that lives in digital world so just scroll down okay and uh, and this is the installation command so just copy this command okay and now open your terminal or command prompt let me open the cmd in vs uh, sorry in windows and if you are on linux or mac you know that uh, you have to open the terminal so space it and now press enter now it will install this uh, coin code globally now in the meantime when it is okay it got completed so let me finish it okay so then you have to run this coin command uh, but before it uh, you have to do this api configuration so here you see that you have to give this api configuration so just copy it and open it in a notepad okay so that it will be very much easy for you to understand what is actually happening and what you have to do so just paste it here now just increase the font okay now here you have to export your open ai api key here open ai means you don't have to uh, give this uh, chat gpt or open ai api key you can copy this open router api key so for that go to your open router profile and here you will find this keys option so just click on his keys and there you will find this create api key just make one and uh, suppose coin okay coin3 and write code coder coin3 coder so just click on the create and it will create that api key just copy that and paste it here okay api key complete api key okay now you need this base url here you see that this is the base url how would you get that uh, base url just go to this page i have given this link in description this open router coin3 coder page and there if you scroll down below there you will find that okay so click on this api okay click on this api option just scroll down below and here you see that this is the base url open router dot ai version one this is the open ai compatible uh, open router api key okay we just paste it here and now here you see that open ai model how will you get that here you see this is the model all informations are there and you don't have to go to this and paste it manually i have given this structure in description so you just copy this uh, whole thing and uh, just change this api key 
because this API key will be different for you. So just change this API key, otherwise base URL and model will be same. Now copy these things. Okay, now again go to your terminal or command prompt and here paste it. Now remember one thing that uh, this export is not recognized as an internal command. This error you will get if you are on Windows because Windows doesn't support export. So you have to just use this uh, set. Okay, instead of export, you have to use the set if you are on Windows. But if you are on Mac, then you can easily use this export. Okay, so instead of export, let me use this set as I am on Windows. So for that, just use this set. Set. Okay, copy this and again go to terminal and uh, again paste it okay. and here you see that i am not getting any error now press enter now this environment uh, base url and this model and this api key for this coin3 coder uh, setup is done okay so remember this error export error if you are on windows you have to use this set otherwise you can use this export okay so uh, now we have done these things now if I go to this GitHub repository, we have done this part. Now you just have to run this command coin. So just again go to this terminal and just write coin. Now press enter. Now you will see this coin. Okay. It looks very beautiful, right? And it is exactly similar as I have already told you that they have made these things uh, from the Gemini CLI. So here you see that first you have to choose a theme. So let it be coin dark, press enter. And now here you see that use enter to set auth. Okay, now press enter. As I have provided this all of this information, they, that's why the authentication got completed. So make sure that before running this coin command, you have to complete this step, this uh, base URL API key and model setup. And uh, then run this coin. This is a simple procedure. Just copy this, paste it. Whenever it is done, copy this uh, export and open API keys. This is this three variable from description. Change this API key, paste your own API key, and after that run this coin. These three steps. Okay. So guys, I am telling you with transparency so that you can understand. Okay. And just write hi and it will give you error and you will get this kind of error here you see that you are running coin code in your home directory it is recommended to run in a project specific directory so uh, I have not uh, run it in a project specific directory so let me open it in a project okay I am just uh, running it in my uh, normal desktop so let me open any project here where is my project uh, let's say this is this is my project one of the project so let me open this cmd here okay now again run this coin okay and here you see and uh, okay open a api key required because i need, i need to uh, paste that things okay. so whenever you will open this terminal you have to paste these things Press enter and now again run this coin. And yes, my authentication is completed. Now, if I just write hi, you will see that OpenAI API error. Now, this is another error because uh, if you see that uh, in my open router, so if I go there, in my open router, if I go to this uh, credits, okay. So under this profile, you will find this credit. So make sure you have uh, credit, some credits, uh, because if you uh, see that uh, this model is not free, uh, for 1 million input token, you have to pay this uh, $1. And for the output token, the amount is $5. Okay, this is the amount. And uh, after that only, you will be able to use this model. So make sure you have this enough credit in your account now you will ask me that how much credit it is pay as you go means you can add five dollar or ten dollar it is your choice but you have to add that payment okay 
so that's why i am getting this error because i have not added any uh, credit in my account okay because I, I i in my last video also i have told you that i have a subscription in cloud 4 so uh, until this subscription is getting completed after this month i will not buying any credit in in this tray solo video also so let me uh, go to my channel there i will show you and you see that in my tray solo video also many of you told me in comment section that uh, i am not showing you the um, tray solo detail demo video uh, by doing by writing some prompt or by making any software or application project uh, because i have not uh, bought any subscription or uh, this pro account in tray because i already have this cloud sonnet for subscription then why will i pay uh, for this trace solo because there are lots of things are getting uh, published day by day two days coin three previously there are trace solo then uh, should i invest in trace solo also should i invest in coin three also no i will not do that i am just telling you the procedure you do that if you need okay and also here you see there are lots of example i am showing you so that you can get the idea and another interesting example that i have found uh, is this one okay let me show you why is that yes this one here you see that create a linkedin clone in one file and make it close and after this linkedin is done here you see in one go it has generated a lots of things in this linkedin clone and it is exactly similar to the to our linkedin that we have seen so this profile and this my network jobs messaging it is their ui is looking exactly similar to the uh, linkedin page okay here you see the post and it is similar to the existing linkedin page okay so here you see the uh, styling is also good and also the generated community forum that we have generated it is also good so you have two options either you can use this open router api key there you have to pay the money either uh, otherwise you can go through this uh, to this coin3 coder and there you can use it okay and obviously uh, um, uh, Yes, uh, if you choose this coin3 coder in this uh, chat, uh, official chat.coin.ai, then it is completely free. You don't have to pay any money. And you can simply uh, download this whole code base and import it in cursor or windsor, wherever you want to use. It is your choice. It, it is another uh, procedure. And uh, obviously, you can use this coin3 coder in VS Code also. In VS Code client plus root code. The procedure is simple just put that base url and choose that api provider as the open router and this model coin3 coder okay i hope you know how to use this kinds of model in client and code right because there are several videos that i have made till now and uh, i think you have you are familiar and obviously this model is uh, beating this coin kimi k2 here you see that this is the sw bench verified uh this graph and here you see that coin3 coder is here and kimi k2 is here so coin3 coder is performing 67 percent and kimi k2 is 65 percent and it is beating this gemini 2.5 pro also it is beating gpt 4.1 also and it is beating cloud sonnet 4 also means it is giving the same performance like the cloud sonnet 4 but it is beating this kimi k2 and gpt models and it is beating this devstral also and the important thing is that it is beating Gemini 2.5 Pro also. And that is a huge gap. It is, it is Gemini 2.5 has this 49% accuracy, but uh, this Quen 3 coder has a 67%. There is a huge gap, right? And also it is open source. Uh, and so I hope that this detailed video explanation is helpful for you guys. And if you want to, uh, try it on your own please try it and let me know your experience in the comment section all the links are given in description so if you found helpful this detailed video explanation please don't forget to like this video share this video with your friends and subscribe this channel see you in the next video guys thanks for watching bye bye